guys, welcome back to my channel. This is another Lulu try on. I'm so excited. It's the first one of 2020 and I'm basically going to kind of go over like how I shop for clothes based on my goals and like my activities, what I plan on doing. Um, you guys know I have a ton of Lulu. If you've seen my Lulu collection video, it's ridiculous. <laughs> I do plan on recording an updated collection so that will be coming soon. Um, but Lulu actually sponsored this video just like the gift giving guide in December. If you haven't watched any of those, I'll have them linked down below. But I'm very excited for this one because with a new year comes a lot of new goals and a lot of fresh faces in the gym. So hopefully after watching this video, you'll have a better idea of what items are going to work best for you depending on what activity you're looking to get into. So first things first, I'm gonna kind of take you through my goals for the new year, a few of them at least, cause I have a lot. So my brother is in the Marines and I kind of, he challenged me and I accepted. Um, I'm going to try to get a perfect score on the marine fit test but also try to beat his score so ideally i would beat like i'd get 100 percent on the women's score what i need to get at least so that means i have to start running and my favorite 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 pant from lulu this has been my favorite for a while from them um is the fast and free tight so I'm all stocked up, ready to go. Running is not my favorite. Um, I used to run track in high school, but I was always a sprinter. I did hurdles. Long distances are not my thing. Three miles isn't that long, but for me, it is. So the Fast and Free tights really, really nice because if you guys know me, you know my favorite pant that I will be showing you um, later on in this video is the Align Pant. It's a naked sensation. It, they're just so comfortable, so soft and buttery. And this is basically the Lux Dream version of that. So this is new Lux. This is a very buttery soft material as well, but the waistband is more compressive for running. They will stay up. They have a double band along the top, and then these are actually all little pockets along the back, which is really nice. So I love these. They're very, very comfortable. They're compressive around your waist without being too restricting and the legs still give you that naked sensation. So I absolutely love these. They have pockets on the sides. Very, very cute in my opinion. They usually have lots of colors. They do offer different lengths in these. These are the 25 inch. These hit me like a perfect 7 8 length. Um, I get most of my leggings in their 25 inch just because once again that is like a perfect 7 8 length for me. They have ones with reflective, ones without reflective. I don't plan on running outside so I don't need the reflective. But first item, the fast and free tight. Love these bad boys. And then to go with that, I have the high neck energy bra. So their energy bra has been around for a long time. Um, they just recently came out with the high neck version, which I really like, especially for running. You don't have to worry about anything moving around. Um, I did have someone comment on the last video, I guess, bust your ladies. This is probably maybe a little, um, gets a little too warm or a little uncomfortable. So maybe you would just want the regular energy bra, but I like this a lot because it's a great medium support. I am not a very busty person, so I don't need a ton of support when running. I can, I'll show you the other bra I normally wear, but the energy bra is perfect for running. You have a thicker band at the bottom, but without it being too constricting or too tight. Um, and yeah, I think this is very cute. These colors together, the little mustard color and army green, how cute. And then an oldie but goodie. I have a ton of these. This is probably like one of the first items I actually bought from Lulu. They're swiftly long sleeve. I think this one is very cute. I like the striped pattern. I can fit into a four in these. It's a way tighter fit. I prefer how the six fits me. It gives me a little bit more room throughout my torso rather than it just being like clung to me. So I got a size six in this. I love it. If you've ever tried Lulu before, I'm sure you've seen these in their stores. They've had these around for a very long time. They have short sleeves, tank tops, long sleeves, crop tops now. Very, very cute. Um, and they're perfect for running, especially I live in Ohio, so it gets a little chilly. I also like wearing these um, just into the gym to like warm up and then I'll take it off and work out in my sports bra or a tank top or whatever. The last item of this whole like little running category I'm showing you is the fleece flurry jacket. They usually come out with an item like this every winter or just when it gets cold. Um, this is so soft, so has fleece in there. So you know it's gonna be 
nice and cozy on the inside. This is like the perfect jacket to wear to and from the gym in my opinion. Once again, I don't plan on running outside, but this is so comfortable. It would be perfect for running outside because there's not a ton of extra material. Um, so it's not like it's gonna be getting in your way when you're running, but this thing would definitely keep you warm. You have the thumb holes and then this would actually wrap over to keep the rest of your hands warm. So this would be perfect. I am gonna be completely honest. I just got this as a jacket to wear around because it's very cute. And I do think it will be perfect going to and from the gym, just like some of the other items I got. I don't like when I'm really, really hot and sweaty and then leaving the gym and have to put on a huge coat. I like just being able to throw on something a little bit lighter and this will do the job. I also got a six in this. This, I don't think I could have done a four. Um, it's meant to be a little bit of a tighter fit. Another goal of mine this year is to get back to doing yoga once a week. Um, I used to do it at least once a week, sometimes twice a week, and I grew up doing cheerleading, gymnastics, track, so I was always very flexible. And the older I've gotten, since I've gotten out of high school, I just don't stretch nearly as much as I need to. And I love the way that yoga used to make me feel on like my active recovery days. So that is a goal of mine this year. I want to get back into yoga. So I did get some extra items. Some of them are new, some of them are not. I told you guys, Align Pants are my absolute favorite. So this is a perfect excuse to get another pair. I'm not kidding you when I say I probably have like 98% of the colors they've ever come out with. These ones I think are very fun. I know a lot of people like to just stick with like neutral dark colors, but I feel like this is a pattern that is still neutral, but a little, a little different, a little fun and they're just so soft. Align pants are fantastic, high-waisted. The fast and free tights are high-waisted as well as you could see when I tried them on. Um, but these are the least compressive legging they have, naked sensation, super buttery soft. If you've tried them on before, you know exactly what I'm talking about. They're my favorite. So I got another pair of those, even though I already have plenty of them to do yoga in. I actually lift in those as well, as long as I'm not doing anything with like like super heavy deadlifts or something where a barbell would be rubbing up against them because it is a more delicate material, but I can't help it. I love them and I wear them like day to day as well. And like I mentioned earlier, I get the 25 inch in these um, because they hit me right above the ankle. Uh, they're perfect. The 28 inch is actually, it's definitely full length on me and I'll even have a little bit of extra material at the bottom. I'm 5'8", so if you're a shorter lady, I would probably recommend sticking with a 25 inch. They also have those in cropped. They have shorts. If you're doing hot yoga, um, I just always stick with the 25 inch. They are my fave. Another item that I basically use this as an excuse to get a new white sports bra. Um, this is my favorite sports bra. I've talked about this in every single Lulu video I have done. The free to be wild has been around for a very long time. It actually went away for a little bit, at least in stores, and then it came back. I was so excited about that because it's my fave. And the very first sports bra I got from there was the Free To Be Wild and it was the white one. I have still been wearing that same sports bra. However many years later, it's held up. It's just no longer white because I've had it for so long. So I got a brand new white one. It has the four straps that cross in the back. This is not going to be a super um, supportive sports bra. It's obviously a little, like the coverage isn't as much, it's not as long. So bustier ladies, maybe stick with the energy bra. Um, but I have always loved their free to be wild, very comfortable, not restricting. And I think it's really cute. The little straps hang out of the back of your tank top. The next sports bra I'm going to show you is actually a brand new one. It's like special edition. Um, I think this is super cute. It is called the New Ambition Bra. I got all of these in a size six, which is my true sizing. I clearly love strappy sports bras, <laughs> as you can tell by the Free To Be Wild. And I thought this was so cute. There's actually like a ribbed material on there. It's Lux Dream. Um, and that ribbed material is also the Lux Dream. But I just thought that was adorable. They had matching leggings, I did not get those, um, but I thought the sports bra was really, really cute. So I'm excited to wear that. That is going to be, once again, more of like a low impact sports bra, just because the straps are so thin and it does V down. It's a little bit, not risky, 
but like you don't have as much coverage. Once again, I don't have much going on, so I can wear that pretty often. These next two bras are actually like are crop tops. They're kind of right in between. But these next two are the same material as the Align Pants, new loof. So like, I was already sold. I knew I was getting them. They're both super cute and I am so glad I decided to buy them. And they're gonna be perfect for yoga. This is the first one and it's called the Always Aligned Bra. It has a high neck and then it hacks it has this little crisscross in the front, which I thought was very flattering. It's like a sandy tan color, so it's not stark white, but it's still very, very neutral. And then it has this really cute crisscross open back. I love that. And because it kind of crosses in the front, you get a longer line bra, so it comes down a little bit for, farther than a normal bra. It has the tight band on the inside, but this part lays over it, so you have a nice flat, flat surface just along your waist, which I think is really pretty. Last but definitely not least, I have the Align Tank. I have a similar top to this from like years ago, um, but I knew I was gonna get this as soon as I saw it launch on their website. I told you guys I'm a sucker for like anything Nulu, anything Align, so I was like, sold, <laughs> I need that. It's kind of hard to choose on a color, so I just decided to go with black, but once again, this is a longer line as well, so it is a little bit deeper in the front and the back has a scoop, which is really flattering, but it has that same, um, the material lays over the actual tight sports bra beneath it, so it just lays nice and flat and it's a very clean outfit. When you pair it with Align Pants, I think it's, it's perfect. It's so comfortable. This is actually a pretty supportive top in my opinion. Um, the straps are a little bit thicker than like the normal sports bras, so I really, really like this, and it's cute. Like I feel like you could pair this with like a pair of jeans. I'm not saying they would recommend using it for that, but it's like just the perfect little cropped black top, and it's so, so comfortable that I actually got that a couple weeks ago, but knew I wanted to include that in here because that would be perfect for yoga. I'm so excited. The rest of the items I'm gonna show you, at least the rest of the women's items I'm gonna show you are all centered around my goals related to my business. I am a personal trainer, I do online coaching, I have guides available. It's a lot of stuff that requires me to be sitting at a desk, working from home. Um, I try to get up and move around, but I want comfy clothes to work at home in, and Lulu has just that, including this long sleeve that I'm wearing right now. I tend to get questions about the outfit I'm wearing like in the video. This is the emerald long sleeve. I was going to include this in here, but I did talk about it in the last video, but I absolutely love this long sleeve, nice and thin. I don't get too hot in it inside, but it's cozy, cute. Love this color as well. But yeah, all the next items I'm gonna show you are all related to travel, working from home, so I can be comfy and accomplish all my goals. First one up, this one has been around for a very long time as well. Oldie but goodie, you can't go wrong with it. The Love Crew. Um, I could definitely do a size four in this, but I prefer my t-shirts to be more oversized. I can tie it up in a little knot to make it cropped tuck it into my shorts or my joggers, whatever. I just prefer t-shirts to be more oversized, so I did stick with a size six, but I figure this would be perfect for traveling. You can't go wrong with a good t-shirt. The name of this next item says it all, especially about how I feel about it. It's called the Perfectly Oversized Crew. First of all, it's kind of giving away the whole fact that I love really light pink colors and really any pastel color but how stinking cute is this it is the perfect material it's not too heavy but also it's going to keep you warm if you go outside um i like that they have a different lululemon logo on there that's something very small but most of them just have their actual little logo not they don't actually say lululemon i thought that was really cute but I like that this is longer. I have a lot of crop stuff, but that doesn't mean I always want to have my stomach show. Um, I love a good crew neck, and I don't like my sweatshirts to be tight. I like them to be oversized, so this was like a no-brainer. I did get a small, um, yeah, I'm, I'm stoked for this. Very excited. The next item up was actually something I, I don't know if I would have normally gotten this, 
but I thought it was really, really cute. It just, it's different than something I would normally pick up, but then I tried it on and I, I don't know, I fell in love with it. So this is called the Full Flourish Pullover. I did get this in a size four. Um, I tried it on in a size six and it just looked too oversized because the sleeves are already baggier. Um, but it's a nice cropped length but your stomach doesn't show or anything. It meets the perfect spot with your leggings. Has the mock neck on there. There actually is a cinch at the top so you can tighten this neck part. Um, I thought this was super cute. It has these little, um, you can see it has the rib lines along the sleeve. It's their spacer material, which I love. Really good at regulating your temperature. Kind of bought this with the intention of once again, wearing it to and from the gym, it's gonna keep me warm, but not make me sweat like crazy once I get in the car after leaving the gym. Um, so yeah, I th I'm super excited about this. It is very different though, than something I would normally get. Last but definitely not least, I'm saving one of my uh, favorite items for the end because I have been loving joggers. And ever since I got the pair of joggers I'm about to show you in for the last, gift giving guide video. I have been living in them. They are so comfortable. They are the Ready to Rulu updated version. I told you guys in the last video, I used to love their base runner joggers, but they got rid of them. And then the Ready to Rulu that they came out with were very comfortable. They just didn't fit me the same. And then they came out with the updated version and I love these. Specifically, this camo print, I just think is really, really cute once again kind of gets me away from just having all black pants, but still pretty neutral. Um, so yeah, I love these joggers. They're very, very comfortable. I live in loose joggers or shorts when I'm working at home. I don't like wearing leggings when I'm sitting down all day. I want something loose that doesn't restrict me. And these are just perfect. They're high-waisted. Who doesn't love a good high-waisted pant? Big pockets. They're long enough. They're perfect. I was gonna attempt to talk about the men's stuff by myself, but Mr. Christopher is here, so he's gonna tell us why he loves the items, he's, why he loves the items he does. Take it away. Okay. We didn't plan on this being in the try-on, but he What's lives in this called? thing. Addy's hoodie. Yeah. Super soft. It looks great. It's got the the scoop fit, which I think is really flattering it has on a gentlemen's. Pocket, right. Does it go all the way okay. through? No. Oh, it doesn't? It doesn't, which I like. It stops halfway through, so there's two pockets, which oh, is really nice. nice. Um, with, it is really with the zip light. As well. So it zips closed, which is nice as yeah. well. Super light, but warm. Breathable. He's been into hoodies recently. He's been preferring the hoodies over the crew neck. Yeah. So he loves that. I would say it's probably your two favorite items the Surge Jogger. Love the Surge Jogger and either the Surge Half Zip, or is it the Dry Sense? The Dry Sense shirt. Super light, but me, when it comes to joggers, I need there to be a cuff on the bottom that's tight around my ankle, um, and this is exactly what that has, so it fits really tight at the bottom. I also need that in, in sweatshirts as well. Uh, need it to be tight around my arms, your wrists. my wrists, my waist obviously for pants. Um, so this is exactly what that is. They're super light, very comfortable. Um, they're perfect for the summer even, if you wanna wear pants in the summer because yeah. there's not that much material. But also it's nice in the winter, you don't overheat when you get actually get to the gym. I'm gonna add something, cause I have like the female version of those basically. That material is phenomenal if you have animals no oh, yeah. hair will stick to them yeah, at all. It is fantastic. Yeah, love those. This is, oh boy, Dry Sense mess, Mesh Short Sleeve. I've tried to get him another one of these. These have been sold out, so I'm assuming. My favorite Lulu shirt. It, yeah. I'm all about fit, and this is, is the most flattering yeah. shirt I've ever put on. Um, nice and tighter on the shoulders and arms. Um, Tight through the yeah. chest, but loose through the waist. So and it has this you don't have to worry about your stomach showing or anything like that. If you have, a, yeah, you don't have a six pack like me. I don't have a six pack. That's what I'm saying. Um, but really nice, very soft, very so light, so soft, dry sense. I mean, it has. I mean, it really doesn't. I can sweat in this 
and it really doesn't show. Yeah. Or um, it doesn't it doesn't hold in the shirt either, which yeah. is nice. Yeah, sweat wicking. Love that. Um, so for this one, I tried. He was at work, and I attempted to get the long sleeve version of that. Turns out I got something different. This is the Metal Vent Breathe Long Sleeve. This is still really light, but it's... This is even lighter, to be yeah, honest. Yeah, it's even lighter, but it's not as, like... I don't want to say fuzzy soft, but it's not... It's not as soft as that one, but... I haven't worn this yet, like, in... In a workout? In a workout or in real life. I just tried it on. Really like how it fits, though, when I first tried it on. Um... I feel very like it'll soft, be very perfect light. for training during the winter because it, it is so light and there's little but, breathable laser yeah, cut holes. I have to get back to you with more. Yeah. So I haven't, I haven't actually. This is his perfect travel work outfit or work item. 100%. Oh, love the flannel. Yeah, like this me, is called Mason's with... Peak Flannel. And right now they're all 50% off. Yeah. If you like. I love that. If you like, or if you work in the office like I do. Casual Fridays. This is the perfect shirt. Super soft. Um, the fit is great. Nice and slim fit, which is what I like. Uh, you can wear it open. You can wear it closed. Yeah. All of the above. He had been looking nice. at those for a long time, and I got him one for Christmas because they went on sale. And then I was like, they're all on sale. Perfect opportunity. So got him a second one. Love it. The last item I want to talk about, which he's used this as well. Oh, yeah. I forgot to talk about this in the last video. Their foam roller is amazing. You actually get two in one. So as you can see, this part pops out. Um, this is like an extreme roller. This thing, I, as you can see, like those are some deep grooves that will definitely help loosen up uh, some of your muscles. But I just usually use it on this, but it's perfect, especially if you're starting off in the gym and you're getting your body used to a new routine, you are most likely going to be pretty sore, um, but that goes for everyone. If you're changing up your workouts, you're gonna be sore sometimes, and it's really good to foam roll before and after workouts. So this is one thing I love from them because it's really sturdy. I like that it has the grooves and you can kind of choose between, okay, I don't want it to be that extreme and use this one or switch to this one. It's like, I got knots in my back and I'm looking to like really get them released. So I love their foam roller. I would check that out as well. And that is going to be it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. There will be a huge Lulu collection video coming soon. Uh, that's going to be a long video. Let me just warn you now, but I hope you enjoyed this. I hope it gave you some ideas for what items would be best for your goals, what you're looking to accomplish this year in 2020. I hope you have the best year. I will see you guys in the next video. If you did enjoy this, if you give it a thumbs up, hit subscribe and a little bell notification, and I will see you in the next video.